So I'm about to go into this room with a patient. This patient I've been seeing for a little while and uh, we've been working. He had a torn Achilles and had surgery on it and then had a lot of residual problems. So we're gonna go into the room in just a minute. I'm gonna put a link to his channel and the reason why is he took some more detailed video. I'm just gonna give you a glimpse of what we're doing here so you can be a little fly on the wall to our videos. So enjoy the video. Go to his channel, subscribe to his, and you can watch all the videos that he's made. He's a personal trainer, super nice guy. He knows what he's talking about. So let's do this. Fatty Manzi from Real Results Fitness, back again with Dr. Story. And I'm not sure which session we're on. We're on a lot. I can tell you. <laughs> okay. Well, we've done 12. Okay, so we've done 12. And something that I thought was pretty cool last time I came was you did the reflex test on my Achilles area. And uh, we were surprised that we got some movement. Which I was surprised. Yeah. In the I beginning. Was, I didn't, honestly, I didn't know I want, to, I want to say, I didn't know that can come back because I thought there would be enough damage to your Achilles and that nerve that it would never come back. And just yeah. as a whim, I just did the reflex, which tells us about neurological control. And all this stuff that we've been doing on you, has, it started to come back, which means it's kind of interesting to me, I think. You know, the body will always adapt to what you do to it. Right. You know, if you want to get stronger, you lift heavier things. If you want more endurance, you do things longer. Yeah, and I, I think something that I, I don't remember if I mentioned it in the first video, I did mention it to you though, but when I would do calf raises, mm -hmm. instead of actually feeling the muscle, I would just get a cramp in the bottom of my foot. And I'm not, yeah. I'm not really getting that anymore. Yeah, which, that's cool. Which I think, maybe you could correct me, but it means that I'm actually starting to use the muscle instead You're using of the muscle. compensating for other... Correct. That's exactly what's almost, happening. Almost like I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, almost. <laughs> almost like I do too. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> All right. Anything else? No. Uh, just, so so yeah. far, that's the progress. Yeah. So could, we'll see. could you show them the the reflex? Yeah. Lie down on your. Uh... <clears throat> So the reflex is you just put a stretch on the Achilles here, and I'm going to put my body against here so I could feel it, and then it just kicks, and then it just kicks, just like you know when you kick when you hit the knee, the foot kicks. That's the most dramatic way to do it, but on the Achilles, it's very simple. You just take it there, put a little stretch on it, and it gave a little kick and a little muscle contraction. So that's what's happening. you can see the scar right there where the surgery was done. And right here, there's a big bubble. It's gone down, I would say, maybe 30%. So that's just part and now I'm going to do a myofascial release method. I'm just going to get underneath the tendon. I survived. I survived. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to use a different grasping tool and we're going to go up the entire calf. Which is something I don't think we did. Uh, we didn't do in the, the beginning. Video, yeah. yeah, the first video we did not do this because we were mainly focused because it was so huge right here that it was like we wanted to hit that in the bullseye. It's like when patients have five problems, you almost kind of just have to pick the first two that are the worst areas and focus on those. Almost done.
We're going to do a class four cold laser, and then we'll be all done for today, okay? All right.